Hey, what's going on, you guys? This is your boy Jay Hen with Jay Hen Travel and Life. And today, you guys, I'm just here gonna show you guys some giveaways and some things that I like to take when I'm cruising. Right now, I got a group that's gonna be going on a cruise uh, real soon this week. They're going on the Carnival Celebration. That's one of Carnival's newest ship. It's cruising out of the Caribbean. So I'm gonna show you guys some of the things that I'm sending to my people that's going on this uh, group cruise. Stick around so you guys can see what I got inside these bags right here. Let's go. All right, you guys, what's going on? This is your boy, Jay Ham. Like I said, so here on my YouTube channel, we do things like unboxing. We do a lot of stuff with travel, um, showing you stuff around the world, around the country, and all that type of stuff, as well as we do unboxings. I put stuff on here about life. Um, sometimes we have some how-to videos. But one of the things I like to do, you guys, I love to travel. I like cruising. I like just, you know, traveling all over the place. I'm actually a travel agent, so if you and if your crew are trying to go on that group cruise, you're trying to plan that destination wedding, hit me up, you guys, hit me up. I got the prices for the low, especially on those uh, group cruises. But, you know, if you're looking to uh, think about what to pack on your next cruise, I got a video for you. You can check that up right up top right there. It should go across the top, what to pack for your port days on your cruise, as well as what to pack just for your cruise in general. Some of the things that I like to pack. But let me get into this video and show you guys what I'm sending to my clients that are going on their uh, group cruise uh, this week. Um, because you know, you gotta have those cruise essentials when you're going on a cruise. So if you're new to cruising, this might help you out. If you're already an avid cruiser, this might help you out too. But everything that I show you guys today in this video, will actually be located down in the description down below, just in case you are interested in trying to order some of these products that I got here. Um, and I'll let you know where I got some stuff from because like the first thing I got, you know, if you're going on a cruise, um, you might not have enough outlets for everybody in the room. So one thing that I always pack and I like to tell my clients to pack with them or I try to give my clients is a, a, a plug, some type of surge, something just to give you a few more options to have a uh, more outlet space so you can power stuff up because if you're like me you know i got my my watch my got two cell phones my portable speaker my gopro my osmo pocket i got all types of cameras and stuff i'm taking lights uh shavers so again these can come in very handy having some type of extra uh power surge or power strip or even something that has the little USB charging ports on it as well. But this one right here is just a three prong uh, power surge outlet. I got that in there. Also, I also packed this in there for my clients. Again, I bought these in bulk. Again, you'll see down there, they came 30 in a pack off of Amazon. These are actually cooling towels. I mean, you guys, cooling towels have been my thing the past two years uh, during the summer months, the humidity. I always got my cooling towel with me. If you're checking out my YouTube videos, you might see me walking around with my cooling towel. You know, most of the times you just have to wet them, wring them out. They tell you to shake them, pop them, and then go on your way and use it wherever you want to keep you cool for a while. But I packed these in there. Um, what else do we got? Okay, I bought a pack of uh, travel uh, wipes, sanitation wipes, and hand sanitizers. So again, that'll be in the description. These came in a pack of 30. They're um, individually wrapped, so they are like hand sanitizing wipes. You can use them also to clean surfaces and um, your electronics or things like that too. But these can come in handy because y'all know what we coming off of, you know, a few years ago. We're not going to say that word, but yeah, those can come in handy as well. Also, right here, you guys, this is something. I bought these in a bulk of a 20, bulk of 20. Um, and these are actually the cruise luggage tags. So these just come in so handy because... If you are an avid cruiser, you already know that when you get to the cruise port of your cruise ship, most people are leaving their luggage outside before they enter the cruise uh, terminal. So that way the porters and the cruise ship can transport all that heavy luggage on for you. And if you know, you have to print out your, uh, what is it, you gotta print off your, uh, confirmation page and ticket to take on there with you and then also you have to print out your bag tag which is paper and fold it up staple it on your bag you know most time if you're getting to the port uh the day of you're looking for a stapler or if you're leaving that hotel in the morning time before you get to the cruise port you're trying to 
use a stapler to staple that paper onto your luggage, then you're hoping in the car, in the taxi, in the Uber that it doesn't fall off or during transporting by the porters that it doesn't fall off or anything. These come in handy right here for any cruise because guess what? It has a Ziploc right here. You just fold the papers up, put them inside, uh, put the papers inside here. Then it has this wired uh, metal attachment right here. You just stick this right here. Boom, no stapler needed. Screw this on and you can be on your way knowing that they're gonna know your room, your name, uh, all that information is going to be nice and secure and especially if you're leaving out of some place like you know Miami, Florida where it can rain a lot this can come in very handy as well as on that last night of the cruise too when you're sitting your luggage outside of your room for the porters and them to come by and take your luggage for you to put it um, off the cruise ship for you the next day. Again, you won't need a stapler because guess what? You'll have this and then if you're an avid cruiser, you'll be able to use these each time you go cruising. You've got to get these for you and your cruising crew or you and your family or whoever you're going cruising with. Check that description, y'all. One of Jay Hens um, must have for cruising. Okay, I bought these in bulk as well. These came in a bulk of uh, 10. And these are just supposed to be one-time use ponchos. You know, again, if you're going out cruising, you're going traveling, these can always come in handy because you never know when you're out, especially down in the Caribbean, you know, it might rain, you know, especially if you're traveling during the hurricane season, which is, you know, June to like November uh, 30th. So these always can come in handy or on any trip, any outing that you're going on. It's always good to have a poncho you know, to keep it in your bag, you know, and they fold up very small. And this one is a one-time use. Um, depending on how you're using it, putting it on, you might be able to get a few more uses out of it. But ponchos is something that I always pet. Uh, these little boxes right here, I love these little travel suitcases here. I, I, you know, you can buy them offline here on Amazon. It's gonna be in, in the description down below. And just what I did, you guys, with these, I like to put little items in them. This time, I put some candy inside of them. So if you got anything special, if you got a, a group that's traveling, you can use these little boxes. You can also put your own little messages on them. Um, you can put your own. There's spots where you can put your own stickers on them, as well as here on the tag. You can write a little message or put a little sticker with your own little logo and stuff like that on them. So I like to put these inside of the bags as well. Also, you guys, I got some on-the-go Uno, on-the-go games. I like to throw something in there just, you know, just in case people like to have some family time or do their own thing. You're up on that Lido deck, sitting on the deck. Um, and then also, you know, if you're going on a cruise, we know we got those Alaska cruises out here too, but my clients are going to the Caribbean, so we know it's going to be hot. So I threw in these one ounce banana boat sunscreen protections. I believe these came in a, in a box of either 24 or 26. It'll be down there in the description as well. I got these in a bulk. Um, then also something else, just like those luggage tags, these come in handy too. I like to travel too with the clamps that you can use over your chair, but these are actually um, towel bands is what they call them. So you can put these right over your lawn chair, over that, um, pull a chair and what these do is they help to hold your towel in place you know if you're trying to save your lawn chair your pool chair while you go get in the water if you're just trying to lay back on your lawn chair or your pool chair and chill without your towel moving around falling down this will help you out because you just you know you put your towel in the chair and then you just place this right over it and then it should hold it in place these are pretty cool because they actually have little messages on them that say you know like life is better at the beach and they're pretty sturdy. They're uh, a nice width, you know, so, and they're, they're sturdy, they're strong, they snap right back. So again, they stretch uh, wide enough to go over that chair to hold your towel in. This is a must have as well. Um, let's see what else we got down in here. Okay, also put in, you know, some Kleenex, you know, you can never not have enough of this on hand. You know, when you're getting on that plane, temperature changing, coolness of uh the ac and things like that so there you go you guys there you have it if you want to see more of what i like to take on the cruises or what i like to give away to people check out those uh videos up there on what to pack for port day what to pack for a cruise the long version or the short version like i said if you want to go on that group cruise you need somebody to help you organize it put it together 
um, do some research for you and help to take all that load off of you for planning that trip, I can do that and handle it all for you. Create a little website so people can book right there. All that stuff. Whatever cruise line you're trying to get your folks on. Carnival, Norwegian, Virgin, uh, MSC, Royal Caribbean, Viking, Celebrity, Cunard, Princess. I don't leave out no cruises. Whichever one you want to go on, J. Hen, Travel and Life, we got you over here on this side. If you like this video, be sure to hit that like button. Share this with your cruisers and uh, maybe even share it with your travel agent. You know, um, yeah, share it, subscribe. Um, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what do you take on the cruises when you're cruising, you guys. All right, I might go jump on a cruise right now, too. Um, I'm out. Peace.